Sluthood. I love that word. Oh my God. Um, yeah, I think that if you are a seriously wanton woman experiencing great sex, sleeping around or not sleeping around, because I don't know if you really have to sleep around to be a slut. I think you just really have to enjoy it. Um, and you create miracles from the amount of fabulous sex that you're having, like becoming multi-orgasmic or making your partner multi-orgasmic when they never were before, or uh, creating everlasting bliss. Well, maybe not everlasting, but at least for like 10 consecutive minutes. Um, or rendering your partner speechless for like two days because of the height of fantastic sex and sexual encounters you have with that person, then you could be nominated for sluthood. I think that there should be some sort of prize, maybe a sash that says um, nominated for sluthood and a panel of uh, smart, experienced people to decide whether you truly are ready for sluthood or not. Um, but yeah, I, I think this is kind of a new phenomenon that really should be looked into. Um, I'm going to talk to the girls about it, you know, see what they think, but I, I want to start a panel. And, um, and I would really like a sash, you know, I'd like a sash. Notable Canadian woman would be one of my sashes. The other one would be nominated for slut hood, because I'm sure I can pull out some miracles that have happened because of my slut hood in the past. And goodness knows, you know, I still, you know, I don't want to brag or anything, but my husband, you know, he's not complaining. That's for sure.